Okay everyone, so in this tutorial, how to add this countdown timer to your Shopify store products using the app Ultimate Sales Boost in 2021. So let's do this. Okay, so to add this countdown timer, just go to your Shopify admin panel. Okay, so now go to the left sidebar, click on this one, apps. Under apps, go to this button, visit the Shopify app store. Okay, so in the search bar, just search for Ultimate Sales Boost. Hit enter and we're gonna go to this one. Ultimate Sales Boost by Hextom. Click on that. So in this tutorial we are just gonna use the free plan from this app Ultimate Sales Boost. Feel free to go and read about the application and read some reviews if you like. I'm just gonna go and click on this one, add app. After that just go to this one, click on install app. Alright so now we got the application installed. So we're gonna focus on the countdown timer. So we're gonna go to this one, flash sale. Let's click on select template. Okay, so now you can add a campaign name if you like. I'm just gonna leave it as it is. Go down to this one, countdown timer. Now we can change the message above the timer. So this one to whatever you like. I'm just gonna leave it at sale ends in. So this title, all right? Then we have timer type, fixed minute timer. Or you can choose generic timer. So the timer starts when you save this campaign. So you can choose an end date and end time. So in this tutorial I'm gonna choose fixed minutes timer. So we can choose from 1 minute up to 1440 minutes. So it's 24 hours. Okay. So you can choose by dragging this around or just add the minutes right here like that. So now we can see that we have this uh, 60 minutes countdown timer. After that we can go down and choose when the timer reaches 0 hours and 0 minutes. What will happen? We can choose to restart countdown or hide the countdown. I'm just going to choose restart countdown. After that let's go to timer style. We can choose between this one or this one. So as you can see we now have minutes and seconds in text. We can also change timer language if you like. I'm gonna choose this style. After that you can also go and customize the color if you like. So top background color, just click on this uh, square and choose the color right here or choose your own hex code. Same thing with the bottom background color and digit text color. Then we have message font size. So the title, if you want to have a bigger title like that and timer font size if you want to have a bigger font size for the timer. After that we can go down to this one, Alliance 2. We can choose left, center, right. I'm just going to choose center. After that just go down to this one, Targeting. We can choose Applies to Products, All Products, or you can choose Specific Products to add this uh, countdown timer to. Just click right here and Browse Products. I'm going to choose All Products. Then we have applies to countries, all countries, applies to customers, all customers, active date, always display. And also if you change your theme, you need to go and integrate now with this button so you don't lose these features. All right, so just click on this button to integrate. After that, we're going to go to the bottom right corner, click on save. Now you can see the campaign list. We have this active countdown timer. We can also go and edit, duplicate, we can pause it and delete it right here if you like. I'm gonna activate it, let's go and have a look. And now we can see our countdown timer here on this product. Okay everyone, so if you like this video, please check out my full Shopify playlist in the description below. Also check out my other videos. Have an awesome day, take care and bye.